Wow, what a crazy world we live in. 78,000 positive cases in the UK today. No idea how many more football games we'll be allowed to go to before everything is behind closed doors again, to be honest. And with Christmas coming up, I'm sure it is worrying that we have another lockdown. But we've got to look at the positives. Football is still happening. And it's fourth against sick. West Ham being fourth against Arsenal in sick. 26 points versus 28. If Arsenal were to win today, they could sneak into the top four. I feel like that is more of a realistic aim for them this season. They played some excellent football against Southampton last time at home where they won 3-0. The sort of ball playing we saw, we saw that from back in the day with Wenger times and we've seen nothing like it since. Really unfortunate though, when they do play against the real top teams, they seem to struggle. And with West Ham kind of putting themselves in that category, we're getting results against Tottenham, Chelsea, Liverpool, but they all won those games at home. This is the difference. This is at the Emirates. So a big game, I think lots of goals to come. We saw a 3-3 draw in March at the Olympic Stadium. I wouldn't mind another six goal thriller. It's gonna be a cracker though. I'll take you guys with us. Let's see what today brings. What a mental time to be alive. Come on, let's go. Just before we go, I do wanna say I had the opportunity to meet Thierry Henry on the way back from PSG Monaco a few days ago. He's working for PSG now and I literally sat next to him. I got onto the Eurostar, he was opposite me and we had a full going conversation about Arsenal, about what's life like after football, about everything. And he is a big legend to me. And what a lovely guy, even now. Um, he, he did predict 2-0 today. He thinks Arsenal can get Champions League this season as well, which is a big call from him. Anyway, enough from that. Let's go over to the pub and then let's go to the ground. See ya. Right, we're at the Fulham fullback. Decent little pub in Finsbury Park just before the game. Boys, what are you saying? We've got Ronan here, we've got Lorcan. Predictions? Um, I'm going to give it 2 1 Arsenal. Yeah? Yeah, I think uh, Lacazette and uh, Saka. Okay, Lacazette, Saka. Same as him, but Smith Rowe and Saka. Smith Rowe and Saka. Arsenal to go above West Ham. Where do you think you'll finish? What, in the league? Yeah. Fourth. Okay, Champions League. Are you sure about that? Sure about it. Mate. Taking it from West Ham. Easy. Yeah, easy, easy. And United, they're useless as well. Yeah, because to me, I, I get the feeling you're really United fan today. <laughs> <laughs> Arsenal end of the league, hopefully, about ninth again. <laughs> right, I've got some Arsenal fans here. Prediction, what are we saying? 3-1. Confident? Yeah, definitely. 100%. West Ham, got this in the got bag. In the bag, yeah? What are we saying? Okay, Odegaard. Prediction? 3-0. Love that. Odegaard to go first. Okay, I, I reckon that cassette today. Trust me. It's all about Top four this season? 100%. Top four after this game. Right, we've got some more Arsenal fans. What are you saying today? Thinking a 2-1. 2-1? Cheeky? I rate that, I rate that. I think Martinelli's going to bag first goal, Martinelli. Okay, okay, I'll look out for him. Good start, that's a good start. 3-0, obviously. Confident? Yeah. 1-0 Odegaard, that's it. Easy. Odegaard, does he deserve the captaincy? No. Tierney. Tierney. I would agree with that. West Ham to kick off. So you've got West Ham fans all the way across here. And just below us. And then you've got the game right there. Lovely seats, very decent. No one has started, only three minutes gone. Lots to come back, I think a lot of players. Wheeler, prediction? Oh, no! Don't care. Don't care? No, no. I went to uh, West Ham over there, and they battered us. So um, I hope we've got all guns from Arsenal today, but I'm not quite sure. Yeah. Let's say 2 on West Ham, I'm being... Not very optimistic, but... Tell us in the comments, does that say 1-1 one, one or 0-0? Nil, nil? I literally can't tell. I literally can't tell. Me and Wheeler reckon 1-1. One, one. I've had two Guinness, I don't know if I'm bad man, but that definitely says 1-1. One, one. I'm sure as well. Come on, tell us in the comments. It's all getting a bit tasty here. Tierney fouled. Everyone's involved. The yellow card given to one of the West Ham boys. I think could foul. Rockets Some guy in the West Ham end there uh, with the lights on his hat. How do you rate that? Very seasonal. <laughs> Penalty calls it. Martelli. Lacazette. Isn't 
referee can give this. Arsenal fans want a penalty. The referee will look at it. I don't think he's giving anything though. Is that a pen? Is that a pen? Pen? Get up. West Ham fans thinking, same old Arsenal, always cheating. It's all going off here in the, uh, in like, the nice area, the nice seats. The police are kicking out fans that might be West Ham or Arsenal. I don't even know what's going on. Eight, Eight minutes till half time. It's not been a cracker at all. No, for me. It's time for a beer and a pint. Yeah. Yet again. Yeah, yeah, a beer and a pint. So two pints. <laughs> <laughs> you mug. What a mug. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, there is actually... There is actually a few empty seats on the grounds, and I do think that's because of the whole cases situation today. A lot of people just thought, yeah, it's not worth the risk going to the game. Oh this has to be a goal. I don't know how Arsenal have scored. Oh my god. What a strike that was. He whacked down his left foot. No chance for going in. He hit the bar. That's it. I mean. I have no idea. I mean, the West Ham fans are giving it big there. I have no idea as that's not in the back of the net. Still nil nil. One minute to half time. Half time here at the Emirates. Nil nil. The best thing about Arsenal Stadium, yeah, if you're in the middle tier, you get free beer at half time. And if you're clever, you can do the duplication glitch. You can get the bottle, and you can also get the draft. All right, Camden Ells, that's a local beer. You can get it all around the country by its decent price. Give it a review. Wow. Camden Hills from Arsenal. It's local, it's a good beverage. Seven out of ten. You've got the big screen here. You've got a nice little layout. You've got another big screen at the end. It's a lush little place. Really, you asked for a beer and a pint, so uh, you've got your beer in your hand and there's the pint, mate. This is not a pint, but that is a pint, so beer and a pint. Yeah, fair play. You're just ahead of the game. Okay, well, you have to queue up quite a while there, mate. It looks it looks quite long, I can't lie. For a 20 quid bit of chicken. No, shocking, man. shocking. Chicken wings. They're giving out free chicken wings to us. That is two kinds. Look at this. Cheers. That is unreal. Not really. Giving out for free. <laughs> These guys are legends. Absolute thank legends. Thank you so much. Cheers. Top guys. Thank you so much. Legends. <laughs> Arsenal just scored. Absolute scenes in the turn style. Martinelli. Oh, I don't believe it. Everyone's loving it. Gabriel Martinelli. Gabriel Martinelli's the boy. And just like that, won the last one. See. We missed five minutes of the second half. It was like the three best chances of the game. It's absolute scenes. Ah, oh, mate, I'm fuming. I'm fuming to be honest with you. Martinelli, what a player though. Great take from Ramsdale there. More from West Ham like that, they'll get a goal. The clock end loves Aaron Ramsdale. Lacazette and Erdegaard stepping over the ball here. Erdegaard to take it. Save. Booze for the Arsenal fans. Big decision, big, big decision. It was Lacazette who went down, 67th minute, still 1 0 to Arsenal, but there is a penalty. They are checking for VAR. I mean, it's unsure whether it's a penalty or not until we see a replay. Penalty for you, Wheeler? Nah, well, we'll see in a minute, but I don't think so. Yeah. You're going to go to VAR either way, the referee did give it. I don't believe it, it's a red card as well to keep out. Last man, I guess, on Lacazette. Like West Ham down to 10 men and a penalty to Arsenal. I think, I think Lacazette's going to take it. A number nine, Aubameyang would have taken it, but he's not even in the squad. We all know what happened with him. Stripped of captaincy, not in the squad. Lack, yeah, Lacazette in my FPL team. I really hope he scores. Lacazette to make it 2-0. Yeah. Oh. Misses it for Arsenal. I don't believe it. That's cost me FPL points as well.
and these West Ham fans love it. They are loving it. That's cost me so many FPL points. back from injury. Oh my god. He's a joke of a player. That is insane. Arsenal 2. West Ham nil. It's all going off here. He is a joke of a player. To be honest, I thought he was injured. Wow. The evidence is absolutely broken. We are below the away fans. Smith Rowe has made this stadium electric. <laughs> Police have had enough. They're getting involved. This is the atmosphere that you get at a game like this. Arsenal atmosphere. Oh, you top them in disguise, Charles. That's the full-time whistle. Pitch of Vader. There we go. Oh my God. He's going all the way. Every Arsenal fan's loving it. He's got away from them so easy. Oh, they've got him. Arsenal fans love it. Second pitch of Bayer of the day. Good game. Find any trouble, Wheeler? Yeah, a lot of bit of trouble. Um, I don't know how to tell you this. Yeah. Oh, Fucking shit. insane. Yeah. One win. We're, we're getting champions then. Come on, Arsenal. <laughs> Anthony Taylor, I hate you. <laughs> but you won. You won. Like, yeah, but it's a prick. It's a prick. Oh. Yeah, it's fair play. They're loving it. Full time here after an exciting second half. It was a penalty that, of course, Lacazette decided to miss. Comment down below if you think there was a pen. But it didn't matter in the end because Smith Rowe decided to show how two footed he was after a wonderful goal. Thierry Henry gets his prediction correct. I wonder if he thought Smith Rowe would turn out as good as he has. Arsenal created a great atmosphere as they went to beat West Ham and went into the top four. Great game, enjoyed it, good atmosphere. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. It does mean the world. And yeah, take care. Have a great one. Loads of football in December. Let me know where you go next.